Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the 2017 Levion Red Carpet Review. I like the aspect of family business. We're third generation and I know they're much older than we are. It's really about the family of Levion and how they support the brand and how beautiful the brand is. Family is is the root, I think, of all society that is it's really, really important. The Levion family is is unbelievable. They are um, Icons. As I walk around and see the pictures with all the celebrities and the beautiful jewelry, it's pretty impressive that they've managed to get to the A-list crowd on the red carpet and make a statement, huh? Well, and what's even more amazing about that is he doesn't pay any of those to you to wear his jewelry. Wow. You know, in today's world, there's a lot of money gets exchanging hands yeah. in other places here. Uh, they love his jewelry. They wear his jewelry because they want to. One of the things that I think is so incredibly wonderful that Levian does is that they use their incredible um, celebrity to help raise awareness of jewelers for children. Consumers don't understand that this is just part of the jewelry industry's DNA. They give back. The fact that you're giving back in such a huge way as you've announced tonight is such an incredible thing. You live by the saying, to whom much is given, much is expected. And tonight you're going to raise a lot of money here, and I applaud you for that. This event is a fundraiser for the Jewelers for Children, and we're paying a $500 donation for each attendee that comes here as well. And we're guaranteed $150,000. It is so exciting and heartwarming to see the next generation following in the same footsteps. We're so proud of their achievements, their passion and determination in earning larger roles within our company. We look forward to the successes and one day passing on the Le'Veon legacy to the next generation. Gem of the year is Neapolitan Opal. The design trend of the year is movement. The color trend of the year is blues and blush. Shape trend of the year is sugar loaf. The item of the year is wristwear. Before any of this success, I used to sing in hospitals for patients, and I it was kind of what got me through the 10 years of not making it, because every time I'd feel like, oh, you know, I'm not where I want to be career-wise, I'd realize I'm having an impact, even if it's on one person at a time, and that's enough. This is my fine soul, take back my life soul. 